often think it's going to get diluted into all the what ifs and baking in all the different capabilities that we think it, it may want to do. Hey Nick, um, today again the word platform came up and we hear it often. Uh, platform technologies and I was wondering if you can share some of the pros and cons of platform as a concept. Yeah and platform again is one of my as you know one of my trigger words right uh, mm -hmm. platform gets gets used quite a lot we're in, in introductory phone calls mm -hmm. people always want to develop a platform or often want to develop a yeah. platform and look I, I get it right you you're developing a product and as an inventor, you can see all the different possibilities, right? What the, what the device can do, different applications. And so it's natural to think about doing a platform. But, you know, we have our, our product development hats on. We're often thinking about the target product profile. What are we trying to solve? How is this product going to uh, be better than other things on the market? What specifically makes it better than other uh, competing products? And how, most importantly, we get this thing to become a product. And when I hear the term platform, mm -hmm. I often think it's going to get diluted into all the what ifs and baking in all the different capabilities that we think it, it may want to do. And so that, that's for me is why uh, platform is a bit of a trigger word. Yeah, yeah, I can imagine. In the, the world of in vitro diagnostics, we right. see several really successful platforms. I have large companies that sure. develop. Uh, systems they can take on different panels of, of, let's say, infectious diseases or blood panels or blood gas analysis. And then the same instrument can uh, analyze a variety of different sure. things all in sure. the same instrument. And then basically you, you don't have to compete for lab space because that one instrument can do it all. That's, That's right. It's got, you've got the, the cartridge, you can put it in, it does the whatever assay uh, is on your, your platform system, you can run it in. That, that makes brilliant sense. I, exactly. In, in, that, uh, in that way, it does make sense to have, a, have one instrument do it all. But I've also seen uh, examples of where one instrument may be you know, catering to uh, a customer base that is very health conscious and wants to, like, for example, knows their vitamin levels sure. or particular blood levels to stay up, is now up to date as a top a or athlete, for example. Whereas uh, you know that same technology, although maybe technologically makes a lot of sense for also infectious disease monitoring, it's actually a different customer base. It will be used in a different space. So, from a market uh, analysis point of view, it doesn't make sense to have one product do both of those things at the same time and dilute your target product Absolutely. profile. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, and that's and that to me, right, is the key word: is target product profile. So, mm -hmm. in the case of a of a of a central diagnostic lab. Look, you've got, like you said, bench space is, is key. That real estate is key. And so if you have one device run all the different panels that you're going to be doing in mm -hmm. your lab, that's tremendously valuable. But if your target product profile says, no, no, I'm catering to a different client, it's not going to a central lab. It's going to the point of care. Bench, bench space may not be mm -hmm. uh, uh, as critical. Or more importantly, you don't need all of this extra uh, abilities to have different limits of detection or to, to have a different spectrum of tests that you're running. It's one bespoke test that you're running for that one particular uh, client base. And then that's where this platform uh, business, to me, that's where it, it kind of falls apart yeah. sometimes. Yeah, so really pros and cons. Like sometimes it's cons. good. Sure, sometimes absolutely. It's maybe, you know, at least maybe uh, for a for later, maybe a later consideration. Yeah. Let's put it that way. Absolutely. Well, thank cool. you so much, Nick. Thank you. Always, always an engaging uh, topic of conversation. The platform. Absolutely. Debate. Absolutely. Thanks.